Yo, what's going on guys? Wanted to bring you guys a Nike store uh, deals video and this one is with 30% off of anything in the store. So this was a crazy video. Uh, crazy fun time to go down there and actually see. Those Air Jordan 7 retros ended up being like 90 something dollars uh, after all said and done. And that is a pretty, uh, pretty crazy price as well as uh, these guys right here. Um, these ones were the same price, like 90 something dollars. And actually I ended up meeting the Shuseum down at the factory store with my wife and uh, we were shopping around the store and he picked up a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, but uh, it was a lot of fun meeting up with him again and we chopped it up with some of the Nike employees there as well, which is always a fun time. And uh, But man, 20% or 30% off of everything in the store, it was absolute mayhem. Like the store was in shambles because people were just running through, trying on shoes and then throwing them around. It was seriously crazy. Uh, this is uh, kind of a look at the stockpile of what they had here. In the museum, um, I'll show you had uh, just a whole bunch of the boxes he ended up picking up. Uh, and look at that smile, man. <laughs> He's happy as can be. Uh, but those prices on those things, I almost doubled up on those Marvins if I didn't already get them uh, because the price was like 90 something dollars. And retails a hundred in uh, like 90. So you figure, I mean, that's less than a half of retail. That's less than I got them from the Nike employee store. So pretty crazy. Some soldiers are 70 bucks, but then again, you got to consider the the 30% uh, off of that. So there was some definite steals. In fact, I did have one pickup from this video that I will have posted um, already, but uh, but you'll see that again in this video. And uh, I mean, really, really crazy prices for whatever it's worth. They even had these there, uh, the what the Co uh, Kobe 9s, and uh, but the, the retail on them was uh, $259. Still, you could have got those for 30% off of that. So at the end of the day, it was a pretty good price, and they had a pretty much a full size run of those. Um, just a random miscellaneous Kobe's here and there, some Kobe 9s and 10s and, and whatever else. Uh, some KD8s as well. Um, not super uh, super discounted, but then with a 30% off, it was a pretty awesome uh, deal. Um, this is the one that I ended up picking up, though. Uh, De La Souls, 55 bucks, and then on top of the $55 of 30% off. So they ended up being like $38. Super steal, if you ask me, considering the retail at $150, and it's just an all-around dope uh, shoe. Um, and I mean, I'm from that era, so I definitely can appreciate it. These ones were $39.97 plus 30% off. I almost picked these up as well as some Janowski's. I can't remember the collaboration of these, and there's a really bad picture uh, right there uh, that uh, has no uh, no meaning at all. And then you can see right here the red bottom on the on these ones. Uh, retail is $100 on these. It's a P, uh, premium quick strike on those. And then they also had the green pair. They didn't have the other two colorways, but they had the green pair uh, for $70 plus like it's like pretty much uh, employee store price or less on some of these things. So really crazy deals if you guys went to the factory stores in the last weekend or so. And if you did see any deals, leave a comment. Let me know what you did see. I saw some people reaching out on Twitter. And there was some what the LeBrons uh, out, out, at outlets for $199 uh, plus 30% off. So there is some definite deals out there, man. Um, and I, this was just me kind of ripping through the store trying to take some pictures of, of some of the deals that they had. I mean, a lot of these were like less than 50%. I mean, these are less than 50% off plus the 30% off of that. I mean, just an, an insane uh, deep discounts. Uh, these ones are 50 bucks, as you can see, plus the 30% off. And Tech Challenges, uh, 80 plus the 30% off, uh, as you can see right here. Kind of the OG colorway of those things. Also, a huge, huge deal. Look at these, $75 plus 30% off. Seriously, that is insane, dudes. That is so cheap for the, the elites. Um, and then uh, some Kobe... Uh, just tens, random ones. I think these are Easter ones or whatever for uh, whatever price that was. Just decent prices all around. Apologize for some of the the fuzzy uh, pictures. Anyways, they had some of these right here that looked pretty decent. Uh, the Tiempos. And I've never seen these ones before. But nice looking leather on the tongue with that uh, etched in skeleton on the back. Um, some more KD Elites. These ones were 150 The other ones were only 75 So kind of inconsistent pricing but different colorways. And so I guess that's the reason why. I'm not really sure. That $75 would have been a steal, though, plus it's 30% off. Uh, probably one of the best deep discounted deals I saw there. Um, 50, 150 and then 200 again, and there's another really fuzzy picture of two side-by-side -side, uh, KD Elites. And, uh, man, $60 for the free uh, 4.0s, and uh, I think that's the, yeah, that was the price of those ones. Look at these aisleways, though. Holy moly, they were in shambles. And there was this was a light one comparison to some of the other ones. Um, really fuzzy picture again. I mean, I was I was rushing through, guys. I apologize, but these ones they had in some kid sizes, uh, and then you can see the friends and family thirty percent off coupons there, uh, and you do the math on those, and it, it ends up being a pretty good deal. 
as I just kind of am showing you guys some of the other ones right here. Pretty crazy deals. Um, and uh, I don't know, man. It's crazy to see the Jordan Retros sitting at outlets in pretty good size runs. And then for the 30% off, I mean, that was the ultimate dagger for these things to be gone and out the door. And I'm pretty sure that they um, sold out pretty fast after that. Um, some more Janowski Maxes here. I um, really like the look of these ones, actually. Kind of interesting materials on these. And then they actually had another pair that I thought was kind of cool. Uh, kind of an interesting little dot pattern uh, on these ones and uh, price point was pretty cheap I think 60 bucks or whatever it was some fuzzy uh, shock turbos or whatever these ones were uh, turbo 3.2s for 89 or 80 dollars and they also had some tech please for uh, for sale as well uh, and considering the 30 percent off is a pretty good price if you ask me and that includes these ones right here which I do have uh, the coloring of these are crazy. I know they're hit and miss with a lot of people, but $85 plus 30% off retail is 120 So that's a pretty darn good price. The shorts were definitely um, priced well as well. $40 plus a 30% off. Uh, they had these ones right here in the red, and they had a handful of other ones as well. It's pretty good prices if you ask me. Um, but then again, leave us some comments. And let me know what you saw from the factory stores. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, please. These um, are some pants, and I apologize for the fuzziness again. But these ones have that press seam on the side. And I have the pants uh, version of those. And I really wanted the uh, the um, short version, but I couldn't find my size. Uh, and then I'll leave you guys with this one. This I have um, the gray and black one of these. And they retail at 200 And there were 140 plus the 30%. Uh, uh, anyway, shout out to the Shoeseum for uh, stopping through. It was fun hanging out with him. And uh, we'll catch you guys uh, for some more videos soon. I think I'll leave you with the last picture of him. Check it out. Uh, just do it, as you can see in the backdrop. Later, guys. Peace. Oh.